his State of the Union speech tonight, President Obama will call for making community college free for students who graduate from high school. And that could affect tens of thousands of people right here in the metro. KMBC 9's political reporter Michael Mahoney has more on the plan. The state of Tennessee is doing this now, free community college. The idea is to help increase the earning power of some folks like Jason Fuller, father of three, who's back in school. I just kind of got tired of being laid off. Fuller plans to get a full degree because an associate degree doesn't hurt, but it does not bridge the wage gap for many. Now, the Obama Community College Plan is similar in some respects to Missouri's A-plus high school program. They maintain a certain GPA. They do uh, community service and... and uh, meet certain requirements. Community colleges already attract some because of their lower cost and the student loan debt issue is not improving. And if I would have put myself uh, with student loan debt, I'd be paying that back until I was probably 40 or 50 or so. But the cost of the Obama plan, $60 billion over 10 years, has some, especially the older non-traditional students, wondering. That's also the case for Missouri Senator Roy Blunt, who used to be a small college president. Blunt thinks there are other more effective student finance reforms. He and others doubt that the president's free community college idea is going to get through a Republican Congress. And Blunt puts it like this. The president's idea, he says, is in the right church, just not the right pew. Michael Mahoney, KMBC 9 News. MCC Chancellor James says he is happy the president is talking about the community college system. He says he's eager to hear more details in tonight's speech.